wife was pregnant with this little guy when I left. I haven't even met him yet. It's nice. You must really be looking forward to getting home. You have no idea. You want to see my family, bro? Yeah. Check her out, man. Did my whole life. You know, when I get back home, I'm going to open up a restaurant. Really? Yeah, Sammy and Sandra's Sweet Salsa Shop. <laughs> it's tight, right? Mm -hmm. You like that? How do I know her, though? She looked familiar. What are you talking about, man? You don't know her. Yeah, yeah, I do. Well, now I recognize her. <laughs> That's a big one, Frank. What do you want to do? Frank isn't that lucky man again. Frank. Go back, we'd have to get refuel. God knows how long that'd take. Let's go up to 14. I've never seen one go that high before. Give me more power. Watch the climb, about 700 feet a minute. Hit a boss, Frank. Just now. Everything's fine. A wind gust just tore out the aerial, but we're gonna keep going. The aerial for the radio? No. The one for the satellite TV. Genius. <laughs> Thank you so much.
The Gerber's on board. Where is he? He's right here. Jesus, fuck! Hey, where do you think you're going? I can't stay in here, man. I cannot breathe. Hey! That storm is blowing 100 miles an hour out there. Take the skin off. Before you get five feet, now sit down. Sit down. Everybody, sit down! <laughs> Were you able to send up Mayday before we came down? We got no response. The radio's down. The zone's coming for us, though, right? Right? Just as soon as the storm's over. They know where to look for us? We don't have the same kind of radar tracking we have in the States. Oh, fantastic. And it's a big desert, isn't it? <gasps> We were uh, due to refuel in Langu right about right about now. So it'll take them a couple hours to miss us. So for right now, everybody, just sit tight. Conserve your oxygen. Hey, Captain. Don't think we don't know what you did. Not many pilots, you know, could have done that. So. Thank you. Yes, thank you, Captain. Chef, but even I know, in no way a cell phone's gonna work all the way out here. Well, there's no harm in trying, is there? You never know. I think the company man's losing it. <laughs> well, what the hell are you laughing at? This is your fault. Was it his fault? What stuff about jinxes? You can't talk like that sitting in a plane on the bloody tarmac. You're the one who put the jinx on us. Oh, shut up. What did I tell you? Bunch of zeros. <laughs> 